I don't know where I fit in this world. What I want in this world, how do I get in this world? False friends of men who hate to love and love to hate. I can't participate in this food room. This world doesn't even want me. My ears bleed by the sounds of curses. Oh, my eyes despise the work of the utterly perverted. My place on earth is not determined by men. Men who conjure up sin, hate, lust, and violence. I belong with the elite, royalty, and righteous, who do more than just attend Sunday school. I dare not take a bite of the forbidden fruit, whose tree has deep roots in this world. I'll end up like Eve, causing my husband's seeds to suffer for my sins. That's the way this world is. I say I do not fit in. And I cannot pretend that there's anything that can feel that needs no refill. It all sucks you dry and leaves you thirsty. Mm. So then, who will I look up to? No example of what to do. Generations of people breaking commandments, listening to man sense, and not knowing at all. Come on now. God, I say I fit in you. Mm. Thank you. But don't fit in. I keep my passport out because I'm just visiting. Wow. Now this is it. People say I'm quite different. The Bible say peculiar. New Age say I'm eccentric. Stop trying to jam me into this puzzle because I don't fit in this scene. They shooting up on them lies, but now I'm a true fiend. They say he's staying stuck in the past, and they be looking at me crazy because I say I want to fast. Mm. Word around the street is, I'm from another planet. Yeah. I try to let them know, but in their minds, they just can't fathom it. No, I ain't from Venus, and I don't know nobody from Mars. But what you fail to realize, I'm a native far beyond the stars. Yeah. Listen, I ain't saying that I'm an alien, but I'm extra celestial. Hey. My father's ship is coming back soon. And our final destination ain't nowhere around the moon. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm disgustingly out of place. I'm walking with the Lord on beat with my father's pace. I don't fit in because I'm the master's piece. Like one of my sisters once said, I'm purposely imperfect because I'm an original masterpiece. Because I'm an original masterpiece, beholding the master's piece, the serenity captures me. You didn't fit in, God. You weren't like the rest of us. We want to be misfits, but we don't love our enemies. Can't forgive those who offend us or even love our families. Our desire to fit in only leads to tragedies. We want to be misfits, but we're not concerned about how you fit. We have no clue. You sat down with sinners, forgave a prostitute. You without sin came down without a suit. You can tell the misfits they're the ones bearing fruit. But don't begin until you count the cost. Carry a cross, that's what it costs. Your life it costs because many will attempt to fit in the door and many will fail. When the master locks the door, it's too late. Epic fail. Lord, I love you more than anything else in this world. I want to be with you more than anyone else. And I pray that my love will shine above anything else. God, I pray that we will not come here to just have a show, um, you know, just to get hyped and go home yeah. and, you know, forget about it and everything. But um, 
I pray that this will be more than just um, a hype moment. And um, I pray that the love of Christ will shine through us, that we'll be unashamed of the gospel. I'm talking to myself. <laughs> but we'll be unashamed of the gospel and um, we'll just go out and share the love of Christ. Amen. Amen. Amen.